Hey y'all. Alright, so I'm gonna um try out this product again, the melanin. Um I I man, I done left my um my water bottle. Um hold on. Let me grab my water bottle really quickly, I'm sorry. So I should have enough. I'm going to blow dry my hair first and then I am going to go back in and apply the hair product. So other than that, how was your day? What did you do today? Okay. Getting my hair clips. Y'all be sure to like the video. I'm trying to get this video to a thousand subscribers. Um, my channel to a thousand subscribers. Okay. So what I used in my hair was a shampoo. And I used a clarifying shampoo what I would consider a clarifying shampoo just a regular two-in-one shampoo I did not deep condition um, my hair is thriving so it is still doing pretty good I'm just separating out my hair first and then I'll come back and set everything else up I could have did a live video, but I changed my mind because I just want to try to give y'all, you know, I want you to be able to hear everything. I'm going to be doing a quick twist out on my hair. Um, for me, I just like to blow dry my hair first and then do the twist out. Uh, I don't know. There's no specific reason as to why I do it that way. That just happens to be the way that I do it. So my hair is freshly washed. And just gonna blow dry it right now. All the pictures I've been taking of my hair, I'm probably going to um, put a video together so that you can see, you know, all my um, different styles and the different twist outs and how they came out. My last one looked as so full, pretty, and it's something that I might walk out the house with. It's something I might walk out the house with.
my coffee today though. One thing I must say is that me and larger twists have really been getting along. Another reason why I wanted to try this product again, one, I don't feel like I had the best experience with it before, and then two, I, didn't, I don't feel like I was like, I don't feel like I gave the, the best review, and I just feel like I want to try it again to make sure I'm not bugging out, you know, so I'm just giving it a, a fresh, just a clean slate. Because I actually see some growth that I wasn't, I don't feel like I've seen it before. But then again, I did use a different product. But I felt like my washout, unless it was just my natural growth, unless I just had a really big growth. So yeah, if we can get this channel to a thousand views, then I can definitely um, come back to doing live videos with you guys. But right now, um, it looks like YouTube is going through a transition. So I'm pretty much just going to do what I normally do. But just do it, I guess, a different way. Like, y'all still will get videos. And... I'll still do the hair videos with y'all. Sometimes I might do lives, but just for right for right now, I think I'm okay with doing it this way because I don't have any complaints.
I have just one more section. But share the video if you think that my hair is growing. If you want to see me do a length check, you can also put that down in the comments below. I don't get many um, comments. I get more views and there's nothing wrong with that, but I just would like to see more feedback or comments. And I'll show you um, how much hair. Came out from my detangling process. Yeah, I'm a little bit sad about the last time I did the um the video. And I don't know why. I just feel like, you know, you buy something you really want to... I want to keep it on my shelf, you know? Okay, so let me get my pictures in from this blowout. Y'all, this is so pretty. It's just so much hair. It's just so much hair. Alright, let's get through this now. Okay, I'm going to do it the same way that I had did it last time which was wetting it a little bit and then adding the um, oil and then adding the cream.
and I'm doing pretty pretty large um, twists in this back section I'm gonna do kind of like this section and then I'm gonna add some oil Put it in between this area here. And then I'm going to add some of this. This is how much I, I haven't used it since the last time, but going to use this much in this section. Might add more if I need it. And then I'm going to brush through the section. And again, last time I didn't really um, rub it into my scalp. I just only the, I did that with the oil just now though. Just gonna detangle. Cause I mean it kinda has me thinking that it's some type of growth. Maybe it did some kind of growth thing more than a twist thing for me. So I had to come back and make sure I wasn't bugging out. Truth. All right, so let me go ahead and start. Because I really want a um, braiding cream. I really do. Or a twisting cream. I mean, I'm, I wasn't really that fond of it. But if I could find one, then I'm all for it. I'm all here for it. And my goal is to try to get through, leave this in for a week. Because normally, when I do my hair, I just twist it. And then, you know, I don't be paying attention to it. And maybe, maybe I was paying attention to it. Maybe I was over, overdoing it. Maybe I was just paying attention to it too much. show you my um I'll show you the um detangling the shampoo that I used I just used the I I used the VO5 um 2 in 1 shampoo maybe sometime either this week or next week probably this week I would probably 
see about the um I want to try the um Shea Moisture uh the Shea Moisture that mask it's like a mask or something mask I don't know the exact name but if I happen to get it then I will um post it up for y'all so y'all can see it okay And a lot of times when I be doing hair products in my hair, I do in introduce my hair to the product. So that might be, you know, what might have happened. My hair didn't expect it and, you know, wasn't used to it. So I just kind of gave it a break. At first I wasn't going to try it again, but honestly I really did want to try it. So I have a little bit left right here. But I'm going to put it with this section up here in the front. Lately, I've been shampooing my hair, and I've just been shampooing it, and it's been so funny. Like, I'm not even shampooing my hair regularly. It's like, <laughs> so. Got a new way of shampooing my hair. But, I mean, I'm still getting in there, you know? Definitely. You can kind of see the way I'm holding my hair. I've been treating it differently. I've just been treating it the way it's been acting, honestly. Sorry. You can really see I'm trying to just get the twists done. No, I might actually like it and I will definitely come back and tell you you know what ended up happening what did I end up doing but my hair is growing 
and I'm just noticing that it's taking longer to get my hair done and I think if I just step up a little bit on the size of the twists then I can definitely knock this time down for sure. But if y'all like the other videos and you like the long, in-depth and thorough videos, you know, every now and then I'll pop in, pop in, you know, and pop out with a new, different type of video. Just like today. Cause I already I don't want too many products, but I mean I just wanted one that I I really did want this one, y'all. I really did, okay. So I'm really trying to. I don't want to waste the product. I don't want to return it. I really don't. I just want it to work for me. So that's why I'm like, you know what? Let me just try it again. I mean, my hair was kind of shocked and you know offended. So. That's probably what had happened. I didn't know what was going on. And then, like I said, I had like a crazy, a crazy growth. But I didn't know if that was from the products or if that was just, you know, the regular growth amount. So, I'm here for it here. I'm here for it. Show me the money. <laughs> Show me what you want to do. <laughs> yeah. Let's see. Because then right after this one, I just used the avocado oil. Avocado. The one that I was saying that I didn't really care for because it was like, it didn't really give off a flavor that I enjoyed with my food. It just made my food taste totally different and I didn't like it and I felt like I wasted money so, so you know what instead of me wasting the product let me use it for my hair it is oil you know so let me just go ahead and use it for my hair waste not want not Are there any other products that y'all would recommend that I try for my hair? I'm still going to be spraying in my trichogen. Remember I had said that I had put the um I had put my scarf on and then I had sprayed in my hair growth tonic, the um the trichogen that I've been using and um I double sprayed it. So I'll try to pay attention to the double spraying, but it's just kind of awkward that that had happened. See how my brush is doing. One thing I like is it doesn't look like it has a lot of buildup. Like, no matter how much you use. That's okay.
I seen this two strand twist machine. I was like, hmm. And this is the last section, y'all. I just want to be able to use each product at my leisure. Because honestly, the size of these twists, I could do at least one right there. I do want them to be pretty, you know, large.
because normally I'll put the product in and then like three days later I will you know put my hands back up in here and you know retwist it smaller the last time I did not make it put my hands up there and started like basically wanting to scratch my scalp and taking it out but let's see how the second time around goes if I make it past two days I will drop one for y'all but this is the twist y'all okay we are finished all right let me show you the um when I was detangling with the shampoo this is how much hair it came out which is really a little bit this is just from what I was when I was using the um, the avocado oil it's very small very very small if you can see it very small from this product Using it with this product. I lost the hairball. I had it. Oh. From this product, this is where we're at. This is the um, avocado. And this is what I detangled from the um the hair from just you know doing the regular detangling and everything. So now I'm just going to pin these down and let me get a little twist. Um a little um few hairpins. Hold on. Hold on one second, okay? This is how I look. Hold on one second. I'm gonna get hairpins and the shampoo I used. Now, it's not every single time that I use this, but I used this one, the 2-in-1 shampoo, and I like that one. I like it. Let me show you how much I used this time with the, um, oh, there's hair in there. Yeah, but just so you can kind of see how much is in there. Okay. The oil, let me show you the oil, where we're at, just touching the end, let me put the top back on that, immediately, oil top, okay, so I'll put the top on, so we need to go on that, and put the hair balls, we'll shoot those later, now, Let's just twist, you know, I want to do this. Let me show y'all the wrapping method that I've been doing for a little bit. I've just been taking all of these and just pinning them back. Which might not be the best look, but... I mean, it's not preventing me from putting my wigs on or anything, so we'll just do this for a while until, I mean, if I don't like the way it looks, I mean, when I, when I take my scarf off, I don't really care for it, because it's not a, um, 
it's not that that look you know that you'd be wanting to go for the cute look doesn't come off looking that cute but this is difficult what happened <laughs> can't put my hand through the thing it's stuck all right hold on do that again gives me a little bit of a look Pins is doing their own thing, and I want to put the hairpin downward, but it's not working the way I want it to. It really is hurting my hands. Hold on, y'all. I'm sorry. Can't really put it in there. The one in the back, I just kind of lifted upwards. And I'll show you what it looks like in the back. And as long as everything is laying, I'm good. As long as it's laying, I'm slaying. And that's that. Alright, so now I'm going to put on my scarf. And because I don't put any um, spray on my hair for the hair growth tonic at night time, this is pretty good, so I can just leave my hair regular. Alright, so like that. Then I washed this with regular detergent because I was like, how do you say it? Um, wanting to wash it because it had makeup on it. So I just want to show y'all what I've been doing with my hair at nighttime. I'm loving the scarf though. No matter what, I'm loving the scarf. And I wore the, um, the hat. I wore the, um, how do I say it? The melanin hat. I wore it from, um, whatchamacallit. I wore it from, um, what did I do? I did something differently with my with my scarf that I had liked also. So tight. Um, 
or whatever I had to do with my thing. It was good, but now it's kind of awkward. <laughs> Hold on. Just something cute, y'all. I can't even figure it out right now. I'm gonna hold you up. <laughs> I don't know what I did, but it was cute, and it's easy to put it on and take it off and everything. can't really see it yet, but it was something like that, and I had it real good at one point. But whatever it is that I do, what I was doing, mm. y'all, that's the video. So if you need me, come back and see me. Until next time, that's a wrap cut, and like the video, and I will see you next time. If you need me, come back and see me. Until next time, that's a wrap. See you later.